<laughs> All right, welcome back to Living 808 Camp Agape is dedicated to keeping the children of incarcerated parents away from a life of crime, and it's been growing ever since uh, it began 10 years ago. That's right. Its founder, Roy Yamamoto, is a local boy from Pearl City who once faced an 80-year prison sentence. How he overcame his challenges and turned them into hope for others makes him a true local hero. Camp Agape is a camp for the children of incarcerated. If they have a one or two parents in prison, we offer this free camp every Labor Day here in Hawaii for the children. They come in the first day and a lot of them are, are afraid. They're scared, they're uh, mad, they don't want to be at this camp. But at the end of the camp, they have so much fun and they uh, just really experience God's love. You see them drop in it. They all accept the Lord and you know, from our first camp, we had 50 children. Uh, a lot of the children that came to the first camp is actually our leaders today. They help uh, do the mentorship programs. They run the mentorship programs. They help with the, the leadership in the camp, and they help uh, give back and, and bring comfort. They uh, are able now to comfort the other children that come that are hurt, and maybe we're uh, going through the same thing as they did also in their lives. You know, I created this program because uh, I was in prison. I was facing life in prison and I was never supposed to uh, be out. I was facing 80 years to life as a career criminal. And I always prayed that God would give me a chance to come out again. And he did a miracle, and he cut me free from this life sentence. And I said to myself, I, I have to do everything I can for the men in prison and for the children of incarcerated. Because when I was in prison, my daughter got a Christmas gift on Christmas. And it was from an angel tree program. And that was the first time she had hope that dad had a chance to uh, make a change in his life. So when God cut me free, I said to myself, you know, I got to do everything I can for the children because I know how much they hurt and the feelings that they were going through in the absence of their parents. So I said to myself, you know, if God ever gave me this chance, I'm going out and do everything I can for the children and for the men in prison. When I see the children come and, and see them really uh, uh, make this change in their life and have God in their lives, you know, it makes me feel so, uh, so happy that, you know, everything that maybe I went through in my past, all the mistakes and all the prison time, and God turned it around and, and now use it for His glory to be able to reach out to the children and to the families and to the men in prison. Everywhere needs a Camp Agape ministry. There's children of incarcerated in every zip code and on every island and, and state. So we need to uh, go out and reach out to the children, some of the most hurting children, and do our best to uh, uh, bring love to them. So he's really made a difference in so many people's lives. Um, I've actually interviewed some kids who went through the program, and um, you know they say how uh, they look forward to that weekend every year. It's mm -hmm. been life changing for them. So, you know, he's really worked hard to turn his life around mm -hmm. and is now making an impact on others. Yeah, thank you for that story. That's an amazing story, and good yeah. job, boy. Whew. Touching. Very touching. 